Please tell me my my mind has not been killed by Chip the ass chocolate monster. <laughs> oh god. Anyway, where are we going now? Are we still in Missouri or are we now in Spagonia? It teleports us. Documents are known as the Gaia manuscripts. Holy shit. They tell the legend of a disaster that befell our planet some tens of thousands of years ago. A disaster? Quite. And according to the Gaia manuscripts, this isn't the first time the planet has been broken apart into pieces. <gasps> the cause lies at the very core of the planet. All the phenomena we've witnessed are the direct result of one creature. The hyper-energy organism spawned at the planet's core, Dark Gaia. So how do we stop this Dark Gaia and put the world back together? Luckily, Dark Gaia has yet to be fully reborn. We most likely have Dr. Eggman's premature wake-up call to thank for that. If we act now, we may be able to restore the planet and my nose. by returning power to the Chaos Emeralds. Sonic, you must travel to each of the temples listed in the Gaia Manuscripts. The planet's power will restore the Chaos Emeralds, and in turn, the Chaos Emeralds will restore the planet and help it heal naturally. What the fuck is Chip doing? He just really wants some tea, apparently. I don't know why. It doesn't even matter how hard to try. Oh lord. So anyway, there's the mission. Put the planet back together, give the Chaos Emeralds their power back, and make Eggman eat his own penis. Or penage, in his, uh, appearance. What the fuck is up with this effect? Why does he seem to have, like, a strange... I don't know. His effect when he's running is kind of strange, isn't it? Oh, I could have been talking to everybody. Well, shit. Let's talk to the boss, dude. I can't believe a little girl like her is still up working at this hour. Running all over... All over like her life dependent on it. Where are her parents? I suppose that's no business of mine. He looks like a weird version of Senator Armstrong from Revengeance. Oh, I didn't never talk to you. Well, I guess I'm never going to talk to you. Now I don't know where we're going. <laughs> I think we're headed back to Missouri. Oh god. Look loading. I just opened a sun kiss during that cutscene and drank some. It's almost done. <laughs> I drink too fast. Oh, hey Tails. I wonder what's up with my voice. I don't know what the fuck is happening to it. I made you this world map. I might, I, I might thought come hand. <laughs> I thought it might come in handy. You can use the world map to travel to places you want to visit. When you defi, when you defiled me, when you decided where you want to go somewhere else, use this screen. Here, let me give you a quick tutorial on how it works. I already know how it works, dumbass. First, pick your destination. We'll go to Apatos first. Try pointing the cursor there using the left stick. Okay. Yes, perfect. That's exactly right, Sonic. Next, let's try changing the time. Move the sun to swap the night and day. Oh, you can move the sun? Great. When the light hits the country, a sun icon will appear on its map. By that logic, when the light doesn't hit it, you get the moon icon. If... <coughs> oh, God. Oh, God. For I going to sound like Peter Griffin for a second. I don't mean to... If you visit a country with a sun icon by its flag, it'll be daytime. A moon icon by its flag means it's night. Wow, what a fucking novel concept. You can press square to move the sun. Let's try changing it to night now. Move the sun to the moon icon. Nice going. Now let's actually try moving. We want to go, we want to, go to Missouri in the day. Find Missouri in the cursor, then move the sun to make it daytime. Wow. I like how you actually have to move the sun. It's like it actually moves in a way that it, like, goes around the earth. Or, more like the earth rotates. But it's like, we're saying move the sun, so it's like... Tails, I don't think you know about what actually happens. I think you mean rotate the earth. But, 
It, it, this game's meant for little kids, so I don't think they understand. Awesome. Perfect. Awesome work, Sonic. Now, next stop, Missouri. I didn't know Missouri was on a different continent. Man, those Missourians. They got their... nothing. They got Mimmo the Elf, and that's about it. I think they're at the... They're at the middle of Mimmo. Mimmo is like a couple of states that form together to create something that looks kind of like an elf. I don't, I don't know why it exists. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, look, it's Eggster. Oh, he threw an orange at him. <laughs> what is... That's like the original Orbot. Holy shit! He's like, I thought you fucking died! I'm busy. Bye. <laughs> hey, wait. That's playing dirty. Come back. Just ignore it. Is everyone here all right? <laughs> hey, I'll just speak and I have no clue what just was said. Oh, there's a moon medal. Who cares about humanity? I just want the moon medals. Let's see. I guess the rumors about Eggman were true. I mean, not that I know much about genius scientists, but I have never seen such a self-centered lughead in my life. Well, he did save the world once, so you can't make him all mad. Doop, doop, doop. I don't really want to talk to you guys, because it would take super long. We're just going to the stage. Also, I wonder if you could somehow clip out of bounds and run the, west, the rest of the way. What would it take you to? Probably just out of bounds, but I wonder how far out they modeled it. Probably not super far, but it would be interesting to look at. Alright, we're here in the daytime. There you go, now you're all dead. I wonder if you could just grind here and get the XP orbs. Anyway, daytime stage. In the, uh... PS2 version, there's like no stages in Missouri except for the boss. So uh, when I was a kid, Missouri didn't have a stage. Hell, they cut out like an entire world in the PS2 version. Alright. Back to lag me to death. How do you drift again? Oh, it's R2. There we go. Let's get some lag. Did I even hit the checkpoint? I don't think I did. Anyway. I do like boosting in this game a little bit more. Because in later boost formula games, it isn't based around your having rings. It's based around wisps. And I think the wisp fucking concept is so overdone at this point. They just... They were only really needed for colors. I don't know why people thought they would be good for anything else. God damn, I just want to hit this. I didn't even want to do that. I'm just fucking around, but what I said was that the Wisp only really needed to be in Sonic Colors, because, well, that's where they're from. I don't know why they keep on coming off of that planet just to come to see Sonic and shit. I mean, they should really just stay on their planet. Come on, we don't need we don't need anybody coming to fucking Mobius. That's even what it's called anymore. I mean, the game version was never called Mobius. It was only the uh, Sonic Bible, Sad AM, and then the Archie comics called it um, Mobius, and that was it. It was never really called Mobius by any Japanese, by Sega, so... Well, shit, I did something... 
I also like how it gives you like a speed ranking. Even though those rankings are probably... They don't mean anything. It's pretty cool to see how fast Sonic's going within its world. Its world. In his world. Where life sucks. There we go. <laughs> don't you just love the flow you can get with Sonic? Everybody's gonna die. The weird thing, the sad, or I guess the sad thing, is that you don't get a lot of XP because you're running all over the place. You're not actually fighting anybody, you're just going fast. Wish you got some, like, experience from, like, actually, you know, getting rings or something. That would make it a lot easier to, like, well, level up regular Sonic. There we go. Feeling good. God damn it. I can never get those in time. Even though it is showing what's in front of me. So I should really be able to see what I'm doing. But I'm too dumb for that. Oh shit. Well, whatever. It doesn't matter. I'm. S oh, it's a repeating path. Okay. I was unaware that there was something on the other side. Alright, this should bring me forward. Holy shit! I need to get up there. Platforming with Sonic in boost formula has never been that great. The adventure formula always had it better when it came to platforming. Boost is really just... Have fun fucking about. No, I'm gonna die! Damn it, I missed it. Alright, come on. I mean, it's kind of cool how it all just wraps around, but still, it's kind of annoying. So I want to go down so that I can get the... Get the metal. I mean, I'm going to need them, so it's like... I shouldn't skip out on them quite yet. Holy shit! Okay. See, Sonic just becomes... He's got, like, a ton of momentum when he turns. Oh, god damn it! Holy shit, I keep on putting myself up backwards. Damn, I love increasing my time because I keep on fucking about... Now there's no more rings, really. I mean, there were some rings there. Feeling good. How good do you feel, Mr. Hedgehog? So watch out. I just really wanted those medals. There we go. There we go, now I'm finally going. Oh, there it is. We just had to run up a tree. Apparently trees hold the destiny to life. Me. Maybe if I didn't fuck around so much, I would have gotten more. But still. Oh, so close. Whatever. I just love it when they pause in place with their mouths open. It makes them look so dumb. <laughs> they like, <"Darp." laughs> Loading, loading, I love loading. Alright. <laughs> hey, Exter. Pretty fast. Behold my new power, Egg Beetle. Go. Is that really a power or just a robot? Well, behold another robot. <laughs> my new power is another robot.
ship? That's weird. Alright, first boss fight. Other than the egg cauldron. Holy shit, I forget. Holy fuck. I forget how this boss fight is won, I forget. There we go, got it. Yeah, he runs automatically on his own. I don't know why I'm holding forward. Fuck. Oh, I got another medal. Sick. You have to kind of like jump over them. You know, I don't know where Sonic was there for a second. There we go, got him. I can't even see where the bombs are. There we go. It's a lot of beating up that we have to do. See, okay, now I can kind of see where they're landing. Oh shit, I missed it. Okay, I tried to attack him, and it didn't work. Alright. Yeah, he is pretty fast, you know? That's kind of in his namesake. Come on. There we go. You little piece of shit. I, I think I am. Wow, it looks like I am. Except for that one. That one was too hard. I also can't see a lot of what's happening. Bombs away! Bombs away! I'll suck your bomb! Come on, I almost got that one. It's hard to see what I'm dodging when I'm trying to, like, see... I probably need to rush at him. Fuck, I couldn't see. Shit. God damn it. Just dodge. Are you fast enough to suck my penis, Sonic? That's what Jim Carrey's gotta say. He's like, Are you fast enough to suck my dick? I love the bombs. Bombs away! <laughs> what a funny joke! God damn it. I have to be behind him when he does that. Come on. Come on, I hit him. Whatever. Bombs away. Got it. Are you fast enough to die? Well, I'm fast enough to get right in your face, I guess. Are you fast enough to suck my dick? Bombs! For some reason it just cancels out the bombs as soon as you're close enough. Well, this is how you beat the boss really quickly. I was being dumb. Oh, shit. I don't have any rings to boost with. Gotta collect some more rings. There we go. Got it out of the way. <laughs> Can you dodge Dick? Dick Dastardly is here to dick you in the head. God damn. How many bombs do you own, Dr. Eggman? Duck Dr. Bomb Man. Are you Bomber Man?
God damn it, you're like back there. I can't hit you when you're back there. I just wonder how I get up so high sometimes. God damn it. Yes, I am fast enough. Are you fast enough, Barry Allen? Alright, there we go. It took me five minutes for some reason. I just didn't remember that you could just run right to him. I'll bite and no bark. So I'm just gonna die if, that, if that's what that means. Oh no! Well, that sucks. I love the music when it... It's like a shitty trumpet when you get an E. It's like... That's what I feel all of my life. Well, no, 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 no. Wow. Is that the Temple of Gaia? Let temple of Assholes? Oh, I have a lot of. It's got a lot of, like, ribbons on it. We must load the next cutscene. It's like Sonic 06. Load everything at all times. Whoa. Whoa. It's pretty cool. Whoa. Oh no, they're going to sacrifice Sonic. What's your hole? There could be some kind of Whoa, what the <laughs> His wings are very annoying. What's that? Hmm. All right, time to shove it in. Wow, you already said that. That's not where we were. Yay, we're putting the puzzle piece back. And then we got another loading screen. Fuck yeah! Do I love loading screens? They just get me all all riled up. They make me feel something weird. Yeah, the piece were on, dumbass. I think we'll know. Chip didn't do anything. Somehow I've got a fucking satellite that's taking pictures of the planet for us. I just thought it would be a cool little project to make. Satellites. You already can. By running around. You're like the fastest thing alive. So... You could already run around the world. Just jump over the fucking gaps, dude. Just jump over the gaps. <sighs> now we must load again. We must load the cutscene. We gotta load the hub world. We gotta load everything. <sighs> Sonic's just a very intense game. What can it say? <laughs> Sonic! Hey, Sonic, suck my con! <laughs> That's what he's got to say. Hey, Sonic, let's go find the professor and tell him what happened. He'll be super happy to hear his plan to restore the planet worked. Oh, and the part that comes back includes Haloska. It can be worth a visit. We can check it out on the world map. Oh, one more thing. I almost forgot. 
From now on, you can change night and day when you're in a village. You can use the pause menu to advance time. Give it a try. Sonic, looks like you kind of spaced out there. Did you catch all that? I was just reading it, dumbass. Okay, I'm gonna head back to the tornado. Gotta keep it up and running. Alright, so, we've been going for a little bit, so. Next time, we're gonna go to, uh, well, Spagonia and talk to Professor Pickle, then probably head to Holoska, so. I'll see you guys next time.